welcome back to my channel and this is Zaisha Sheikh. Well, in today's video, I am going to focus on solving crossword puzzles. So I've got two crossword puzzles with me and which I'm going to solve along with you. But prior to that, let me tell you some benefits of solving crossword puzzles. Okay, there are lots of course, but I'm going to share two of which. First one is perseverance. It's definitely required to solve the puzzles. Well, the second one is problem solving. Problem solving skill is so, so important while solving a crossword puzzle. And why is it so? Crossword puzzles could be tricky and finding the answers could be very difficult. Hence, there's a lot of pressure on Mr. Brainy. Ha! Huh. Hence, you need to really work on your problem solving skills to find the answers. All right. Okay, before we continue, I'm going to share something, okay? I'm going to share a few tips and tricks with you, which you are going to first listen, understand, then apply, okay? Try solving the puzzle on your own. Pause the video for a while, and once you're done, then you get back. In case you're stuck in the middle, don't worry. Come back to the video and watch the video completely, and that shall help you out. Now, how would you get the crossword puzzle? All you need to do is go to my Facebook group that's Learn and Teach with Aisha Shay. It's the same name as my YouTube channel and you can go there and download. All right. Once you download, then you can take a printout and work on it. So that is easy peasy lemon squeezy and here we go. Stoppy, stoppy, stoppy. As I told you, there are a few tips and tricks that I need to share with you. The very first thing is, okay, uh, you need to first look at the two numbers, okay? The number sentences that has two numbers and you start solving with that. And look for the very easy one like this. This is a very direct one. You can answer the question directly over here like eight plus seven and you get the answer. So this is a direct one. Look for the number sentences, which is kind of direct like this. The second thing is when you have something like this, when there is a missing number in the middle, all you need to do is one count take forward from the small number until you reach the big number. This is the trick. Okay. So what you can do is pause the video and try solving the puzzle by yourself. Once you're done, you can get back to the video and watch the rest of it. All right, then here we go. This is the first puzzle that I made for you and how do we solve it? Quick tricks, okay? Look for the number sentences that has got two numbers in it, okay? So we have got two numbers here, one and two. This is another number sentence. I've got two more numbers here. And one more number sentence here, which has also got two numbers. So I can choose any of it, all right? I want to start with this. This seems to be very easy. Eight plus seven, that's a very direct answer. So what do we do? The big number goes in the head and the small number in the hand. So eight goes in my head and seven in my hand seven in my hand so after eight count after eight okay counting forward after eight it's nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen so what's the answer it is one and five fifteen cool so we got one set of answer now have you seen something a second puzzle is automatically solved so 15 plus 5 makes 20 so we solve the first one and automatically a second one is solved as well now comes uh, now let's focus on the third one so what is it eight plus how much will give you nine a quick trick for this is start counting from the small number until you reach the big number so eight okay and as you count forward just open one finger every time okay after eight it is nine so we already reached the number that we desire so how many fingers it's only one Ta -da! So 8 plus 1 gives you 9. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Puzzle number 2. Work out the sums in such a way that the last column adds up to 20. The last column should add up to 20. Alright. The same tips and tricks we follow. Okay. Look for a direct number sentence. If you don't find one, look for the missing one. And the trick is start counting forward from the small number until you reach the big number. Cool. Okay, let's get, let's search for one. Oh, I found a direct one. Nine plus one. Another one here. One plus four. So let's go for one plus four. That seems to be the very easiest one. One plus four. And what's the trick? The big number in your head and the small number in your hand. So four goes in your head and one in your hand. 
Count forward from 4, it's 5. So 1 plus 4 gives you 5. So we solved 1. Now this one. 9 plus 4. So 9 goes in your head and 1 in the hand. And count forward from 9. It is ta -da, 10. So 9 plus 1 gives you 10. So we solve the second one. Have you seen the third one is automatically solved here? So 10. Oh, sorry. 10 plus 10 gives you 20. That's sorted. Anything else? Yes, here. Yeah. 9 plus dash is equal to 15. So 9 plus what will give you 15? Remember the trick. Start counting from the small number until you reach the big number. Start counting forward from 9 now. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. How many fingers? It is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. There we go. So 9 plus 6 gives you 15 and we have solved the puzzle. I hope you got all your answers right. Happy learning. Oh, that was the end of the video. Um, so that is it for today. And I hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked the video, then do share with your friends and shower love. Okay, so I'll see you in my next video. Until then, take care. God bless you. Much love and don't forget to spread kindness.